All right, let's see what we got here. We ordered one of these 39 millimeter carbs made in China. We just opened the box. A friend of mine over at Washburn's Metal here in Orange, California, put one on his bus and he said he's having good results. So I took his advice and I ordered one. $124 shipped, can't beat it. So it looks like it came with some, some little brushes and things to poke out openings and jets and whatnot. Um, let's see what we got here. to hold it down from the carburetor base to the manifold. Got some manifold gaskets, some nuts, some jets. Cool. And there it is. I guess the manufacturer is Kipa, K-I-P-A. Never heard of it. Very generic, but um, it's a much better looking carburetor than the factory. Yeah. Factory castings are not this shiny. It's almost like they polished it. Um, looks pretty spot on to um, an original German one. A rubber cap to cover that probably from, so that doesn't get bent in the transport. Uh, very clean, very nice looking carburetor. It's got electric choke. And it's never had gasoline in it. Feels like, feels tight. What a good dealer. And then this is something I noticed on the image um, before I bought it. So an original German carburetor right here just has a little post coming out. So when you slide a hose over it, you know, the the, the post that is inserted in, into this um, metal housing here is just pressed in so it can pop out. Cars have burned because that little brass fitting has just popped out. And it looks like they figured that out. It would be better to thread, thread one of these attachments in. Um, this this is kind of similar to what an original one would have and there's nothing that doesn't have these teeth on it to hold it to hold it in so that was that's a good addition to this carburetor and uh, we'll have to see how how responsible or how responsible how responsive and reliable this carburetor is and uh, go from there cool keep up there it is. Kind of pretty.